The Garvin Institute has a wide range of research programs focused on the challenges of ageing. These range from cancer, diabetes and obesity, neurodegenerative disorders, autoimmune disease and osteoporosis with its crippling effects in ageing. My own personal research interests lie very much in using adult stem cells as a means to overcome neurodegenerative disorders. We work hard to isolate nerve stem cells from the adult, grow them in culture, figure out ways to make them multiply, and then try to work out what do we need to do to convert them into the different types of specialised nerve cells that we need for Alzheimer's or Parkinson's or hearing loss. This is a long road, but the journey has begun and it's a very exciting one. We can already isolate, in our particular case, from the nerve cells that line the nose, our sense of smell, we can isolate stem cells, grow them in culture, multiply them up by adding growth hormones and different growth factors and different other chemicals. And we're just now beginning to understand how to convert them into different types of nerve cells, for instance, those that we lose in Parkinson's disease. At present, we can only do this with about 0.1% of the stem cells that we isolate but that's a start, and we now need to optimise those conditions, understand it a lot better to get to the point where we can begin to routinely think about replacing cells that are lost in these devastating neurological disorders as we age. It's a really exciting area, and around the world, enormous progress is being made, but it is taking a long time. It's very painstaking research, but the end result is so important and we know we will get there. So it's a very exciting time in this area of medical research.